Welcome to First Take. In First Take, I play games I have never played before and record my reactions and impressions. This segment is not limited by game type or system. We will play old games, new games, bad games, awesome games, annoying games, weird games. The best part about First Take is that you, the viewers, will be making the decisions on which games I play. So you will have a major part in this aspect of the channel. So get your popcorn ready and experience First Take. Hey, what's up, everybody? Big J Glees here. Uh, we just got some Red Faction right here. We just downloaded, actually. It was on sale at Steam, so uh, I got this game for like a dollar. It's like a dollar fifty or something. Uh, originally twenty bucks. So as I'm looking around, I'm just looking at this landscape, and man, these graphics are just really, really good and really cool looking. Uh, the atmosphere and uh, the mountains, look at the sun, the way that comes through, and the clouds. I mean, it's this is really, really well done. I'm, I'm pretty impressed. This is actually the first screen of the game. So I'm just going to do a little bit of a playthrough for the first couple minutes and give you guys a little broadcast. Pick it up so we can trade it. All right. Pick that up. Salvage is found by destruction. All right. So what does that mean? I gotta destroy this thing? Bang. Okay. L trigger does the overhead smash. R trigger is uh looks like it's like a side hit. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go back up here. Is there anything else over here? How about this? Can we hit this? Oh, look at that! I can break the wall! Oh, man. I can duck. Can I Can I duck through there? Oh, snap. Swap weapons. RB. Tap RB to swap for last used weapon. Okay. So hold and tap. Alright, we got that. Man, it's like almost low charges and take down that big structure right there. A big right structure. Now you can set two charges before you detonate them. Remember, you can swap weapons and still use the detonator. Come back to me if you run out of charges. Uh, what do we got here? So, hold up. Hurry up, Alec. Dan, what the hell is going on? Who's the girl? You know what's going on. Alec, the Red Faction could really use a guy like you. To do what? What are you people doing out here? Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. I'm not a terrorist, Dan. You think I am? The EDF are wiping out towns. Alec, we need help. Oh, this structure here, I'm sure. You got me into enough trouble, Earthside. I just want to do honest work here. That's what we're fighting for. If we don't resist, they'll take everything. Enough. You'll see I'm right about this. Hey! Hey, we got some more stuff. Ten. Oh, we're, we're gonna... Let's put these things all over, man. Let's get these panels out of here. Boom! <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Yeah, so trying to log on to this game, I didn't realize that Xbox Live runs on PC as well. And to play this game, you actually have to sign in to your Xbox Live account. And I wanted to change my Xbox Live account. And I ran into a whole bunch of issues. When you log in, uh, if you have a Windows 8 PC, your computer's hooked up to a live account automatically. You have to have one to log in. And once you log in to your computer with a live account, it knows that you're logged in with that specific live account. So when I signed into this game, it automatically logged me in under my live account that's attached to my computer. But the live account that was attached to my computer isn't the live account. Whoa, no! Oh, man. Well, that's not good. 
uh, isn't the live account that is attached to my gamer tag for Xbox. So that was a whole mess. It took me like an hour. I had to talk to customer service and everything just to get some things done to get this up and rolling. But, you know, it's up and rolling now. I just, you know, got 800 gallons of metal fall on my face. And, you know, we're enjoying the game right now. We're playing, so... But just be aware of that. It actually logged me in and it, it created a username for me with my with my computer live account, which was uh, it was just weird. Like randomly generated names. I don't even I don't get it. Yeah. Alright, so what is the point of this game here? I mean, I'm just breaking stuff. I mean, it's pretty cool and all. I mean, I do like to break stuff, but... This is getting a little out of hand now. Breaking down structures and walls and stuff. It would be nice if I knew what type of stuff I could use. I'll tell you what, the physics in this game are great. No, I shouldn't say great yet. I'm not gonna say great yet. We're gonna we're gonna take that back. But they're pretty good. They're pretty cool. I mean you can break like everything. Look at this. This is crazy. To think I never played this game, it kinda boggles my mind. Uh, I probably should have went upstairs before I did that. Can I jump? Yes, I can jump can't make it though let's see if I can do it again yeah you don't want to uh, you know bust your path now I can't get up here yes all right let's see this bust some of these some of these desks up I'm afraid I'm gonna bust through the floor yeah look at that oh man everything breaks yeah this is crazy this is awesome Holy! Okay, okay. I'm gonna bust right through. Nah, there's gotta be something else up here before I bust through the floor. Look at this. I can even break the ledge, the windowsill. How about this thing? Oh! Looks like your energy does come back, because my energy was halfway empty. Alright, let me see if I can fall through. Yes, I can. Look at that. Alright. Tons of junk on the floor, but apparently this is what I'm supposed to do, so... Yep, and I keep picking up more things. Like, I feel like I can't see the things that I'm picking up. Like, it's just like like that. Like, what was it? Like, if I knew what it was, I'd be able to pick them up a lot easier. You can't even see them. It's just like random junk. It's like, oh, that, that looks like something that I need that I just can't see, though. Can't say it, but... There we go, more junk. Let's do this. This looks like a support, right? Yeah, it looks like a support to me. Uh, this looks like a support over here. Let's do this. And let's do this. And let's do... I think I got something on the other side here. Let's do this right here. Uh, I'm gonna get this wall right here. Nah, nah, this beam right here. This beam, this beam. There we go. I better get out of here before I detonate this. That's that's for sure. Alright. Let me get back. Let's get a nice little view here. Ready? Boom! Hey, got it! Look at that! Man, this game is awesome. I want to thank you for making it all the way to the end of the video. If you made it this far, I would think that you liked the video, so I would suggest pushing that like button. Also, check out the nice little background I've been working on. I'm trying to really get this thing down and really get these animations going. So right here we have a retro throwback arcade with a push subscribe blinking icon for all of you 8-bit retro gamers, arcaders out there. And on the left, for you current gen gamers, we got a button you can push.
push right on the video. Thanks and game strong.